Okay, so this is going to be an off-the-cuff video talking about the differences between our two warming lactation massagers. This is our warming lactation massage pad, and it usually will come in a set of two. You can get the singular, but most of the time we sell them in a set of two. And this is our Periwinkle 3-in-1 warming lactation massager. So they both have similar features, but obviously very different shapes. So starting with our warming lactation massage pad, you're going to hold down the heat button here, and that's going to show that it's starting to warm up. If you press it through here, you'll see different heat settings. So if you want to go to the vibration, you're going to turn it down or up. So there's two different vibration modes. Um, they just get more intense. Because of this curvature here, it fits really nicely, just kind of holding in. And I use it just to kind of get my letdown started before I'm ready to pump. Now the Periwinkle 3-in-1 Warming Lactation Massager has up to 45 different customizations of heat and vibration settings. Hold down the power button here. You're gonna hear the vibration. To turn on the heat, you're gonna press this and you're gonna see the different heat settings change. And then this is going to be your intensity and changes of vibration. You can also put it in here just like this one did. But for this shape, I think it works really great to get kind of the kinks out. So we'll kind of just help kind of push it down. Um, you know, if I went a little bit longer between feedings or something, it's really great to kind of just like target those areas. This one needs a little more like specialty. This one's my like everyday one. And again, everyone has different uses for them, but that's just how I personally use them. They work very well to help your letdown come a little bit faster. And they also help shorten your pump time. So whichever one you decide to go with, I always recommend you start with the lower setting first and then you can work your way up and kind of see what works best. It's best to play around with a couple different settings and just see how your body responds. Check them out and let me know if you guys have any other questions about these in the comments.